Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to make a doll sized emoji pillow. We can take ideas from our life size emoji pillows as well. So, taking ideas from our life size emoji pillows, we are going to make one for our dolls. So, let's begin. Yay! So, to make one like this, we are going to require yellow cloth which you can get in any craft store or in a cloth shop where you can get clothes which are raw markers and you can also always stitch the design like you can see in the life size pillow they are stitched but however to make it easier we are going to use markers because stitching can be a really long process so scissors just to cut your design cotton to fill in your pillows and needle and thread of the same color so that it hides with the stitching and the cloth. The next one is optional just to make your circle perfect you can use something round. I am using this. Here are some small decorations for nail art. I am going to use them to trace on the cloth so that the circle is precise. So let's begin. So I start by taking a round object such as this decoration box. You can use anything round like that. To trace the circle I am going to use a yellow marker so that if it becomes messy it does not look untidy. So I will catch my circle and then trace around it very precisely in order to make my circle precise. Also make sure the yellow color marker which you have chosen is a little more darker than your cloth. So that you can at least see the markings. Now it's time to cut this design out. But before cutting it out I am going to make my design. You can make any emoji design you want. This time I am going to make a design which has two hearts in his eyes and a smile. And take your time while making the design so that it is as precise as you want. After making your design, you can cut it out. After cutting out your design, take your object and your marker and trace another for the back side of the pillow. Again, make sure it's precise so that both of the objects I mean sides of the pillows are equal. After tracing and cutting out the back side of your pillow, we are going to take both of the sides. Then we are going to take the front side, place it and then we are going to take the back side and place it on top of the front side. So that both of the good sides are facing down. Now it's time to stitch it. So for that I am going to first tie a knot on my thread, then I am going to take it, then I am going to start from any point of this circle. I am going to start leaving a distance and then pulling my thread. Next I am going to take my thread again and then push it right here, then take it out and then take it to this side again and then pull it and keep on repeating the same step until you reach here and leave a small gap so that it can be turned upside down or say it inside out. After stitching we are going to leave a small gap as I told before so that it can be turned inside out. So just open the gap and try to pull the cloth in just like this, once it starts to come out, push the cloth in like this. If you are finding it difficult to push with your fingers, you can use the edge of your marker to push it. Or you can also use a pencil if you want. Keep pushing until you see the desired shape. Next, I am going to take cotton or you can also use pillow fluff 
However, I am going to use cotton because I don't have pillow fluff right now. So I am going to fill it in. After filling in the desired amount of cotton. Now to sew the edges closed, I am going to first fold the cloth like this. Then I am going to put in the needle. Fold the cloth of the other side as well and then push it in. After bringing it to the front, make sure the knot is at the back side. I forgot to mention that you need a new thread for sewing this leftover. Now I am going to repeat the same step. Make sure your cloth is folded. After finishing the stitching, I am going to take black marker and I am going to color the thread so that I can hide the stitching. Right like this. And you are done with making your doll sized emoji pillows. Make more of different designs. Don't forget to compare them with your life size emoji pillows. Don't they look similar? Well, yeah. And now our dolls have their own emoji pillows. So I hope you like my video and subscribe to my channel so that I make more videos. Bye and thanks for watching.